If you're following Johnny Depp and news around him, you might know this actor, Sidney Sweeney, and Johnny were rumored to be in this movie, Day Drinker. Now, some people are saying that Sidney Sweeney might be using Johnny's name for a little attention, which happens quite a bit to Johnny, so that wouldn't be a surprise. But Amber's friend here, Eve Barlow, who's still on X and still once in a while defending Amber, is saying that Johnny's PR set this up somehow, maybe? Well, here's what she said. The PR machine that Johnny Depp continues to deploy has one obsessional focus, and it's at once both pathetic and truly devastating. The man has no ability to just move on with his life without pushing down the shoulders of women. More power to Sidney Sweeney. What? That's so bad, it's kind of shocking. I mean, Johnny's the one who moved on with his life. He doesn't even mention Amber. And not that many people, if anyone around him, who's close to him, mention Amber. So I might be lost here, but I don't see what she's talking about. Except for the implication that Johnny's PR somehow wanted to get out this news and connect Johnny to this actor that not everyone's heard of. I didn't hear of her before this. To get clout? To get attention? Feels a bit off. But I must say, and this is serious, not sarcasm, props to Eve for leaving her comments on. She got about 170 on this. I cut out some, can't read them all, but let's get a little preview. Not Jean Thurney says, I tend to see this in reverse, that she's the one having difficulty moving on and it's shoving herself down the public's throat. All the consistent PR she's been cycling through, I see her in the media more frequently than him in regards to what she's up to. Well, I mean, Johnny's in the media as far as what he's up to, but that's business. Movies he's in. Things like that. Not just Johnny's hanging out in the park in Spain taking a picture for the Daily Mail. Johnny's in a new movie. Johnny's got an art gallery. Johnny's playing a show. Something like that. It's not BS news, it's real news. But yes, it's in reverse that probably Sweeney, Sydney, whatever her name is, has her PR team using Johnny to be connected to, because let's face it, who's got more fans? Johnny or Sydney, Sweeney, Sweeney, Sydney, whatever her name is. Yeah, you guessed it. Johnny's probably got about 35, 40 million more. Me T says, what in the living hell are you talking about? It's legitimate people who are unpaid and actually supported him. And that was based on evidence. We heard the audio and watched the VA trial. The one in the UK was run by a judge who worked for Murdoch. Hey, I'm proof, man. Watch my channel before I found Johnny News and there was not a mention of him in like a hundred, two hundred, three hundred videos or something like that. But I became a fan when I heard the evidence that made sense to me. I've always been a fan here and there, but if you get my drift, an actual fan. Always liked Donnie Broskow, 21 Jump Street, you know. But when I saw the evidence, yeah, that's what got my support. Tug Simp says, you know what's sad, Eve? You knew her well. You know she's an abuser. You spout all this feminist BS, yet you turn your back on survivors for an abuser. Didn't you see the signs that once you had no purpose, she'd kick you to the curb? You could have helped. Rebecca says, who's Eve Barlow? Well, no offense, but you probably should know for better or for worse. She's notorious. Unless that was sarcasm. DeBrock says, hey Eve, remember that time you got kicked out of court for trying to tamper with witnesses? I do. You inadvertently helped to sink your girlfriend's case. Congratulations. And shout out to Brock, by the way. Tara T says, he's moved on with his life just fine, which is what I was saying. Apparently he has. The one not moving on is Miss Heard and her PR team once again failing in their ongoing smear campaign against debt. Phoebe says, you're so pathetic, always mentioning his name to get attention. Knowing damn well you attempt to run PR for Amber, if you did literally any research, you'd know it was a random person on X, not anyone from his team. 
AH also released into the dumps to fire PR. And this person here agrees, didn't come from Depp's team as it turns out, you're just another ignoramus on the internet, go figure. Eh, fair enough. And Olga also says it was given by a random person on Twitter, I guess she means X. Johnny's long since given up on Hollywood, and one could realize that this information is false and his PR team is not using a stranger's name to get attention. Anyway, like I said, can't read them all, but I think you get the point, and I'd bet a lot are similar to those that I read. I find it funny that Eve is trying to make people believe that somehow Johnny's PR team, whoever they are, wants his name connected with someone who's, once again, not very known. No offense, just don't really know who she is and don't really care so much. If you're not subscribed to consider it, that's all I got for now. If you don't subscribe, I'll be sad, but I'll get over it. See you next time.